All right. Tuesday morning pow uh, boot camp, not power hour. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get started warming up. Quite the intro right away with the wrong class name. We're gonna just start, because it's morning time, by doing some high knee twists. Got a fun class today, Cardio City. We're doing EMOMs the whole time. It's gonna go by quick. Get our heart rate up, get a lot of cardio in. Couple more, be sure that you're twisting your torso as well. Warming up the full body. And done, now we're just gonna do some butt taps. Gonna start by doing some steps, then we can move into our jogging or jumping jacks. This always feels good right away in the morning. Let's just take it slow and work our way up. Doing some butt kicks. From here, let's do some arm circles backward. Four, five, five, four, three, two, one, and forward for ten. Three, two, one. All right. Big reach all the way up. Let's do a little flow. Exhale. Reach down for your toes, bend in your knees. Try and reach as far as you can. Move side to side. Halfway lift, hands come to our shins. Flat back, look forward. Pull your shoulder blades back. This should feel really good opening your collarbones. And then fold again, plant your hands. Step one foot back, step the other foot back. And reach your hips up nice and tall. Big stretch, pedal out your feet back and forth. From here, roll forward. Pop your knees down until we're in a tabletop kneeling position. Do a couple cat cow, drop the belly. Look up. Cat curve in. Calf look up. Spread the collarbone, shoulders back. Cat look in, squeeze your belly. Neutral tabletop position here. Let's do a couple bird dogs on each side. One, our hands, our back sides, our core. So left leg back, right arm forward, press forward. And down, switch sides. Left hand, right foot, press, press, press. And down, keep going. Point right hand. And switch. And switch, let's do one more on each side and then a crunch. Switch sides, left hand. And down. Now right hand up, crunch five times, elbow to knee, we're going five, four, three, two, one, switch sides, left hand forward, now we go elbow to knee, crunch for five, four, three, two, one, Woo. Bring it back down. Now let's roll forward all the way onto our bellies. You can do a nice little twist if that feels good. Warm it up. From here, we're just going to do a couple wide raises. Hands forward, thumbs up. And lift and lower. Two. Three. Four, hold the last one right here at five, hold it here, move to T, move to A, back forward for Y, T, A, forward 
it again. Y, T, A. Two more. Try and keep your chest lifted. Y, T, A. Last one. Y, T, A. Hands back down underneath your armpits. Press up to a tabletop position. Take a couple some movements, hip swivels back and forth. Plant the back of the feet, press the hips up high to downward facing dog. And then slowly move your legs all the way up. Walk it forward so your feet are about wider than mat width apart. Hands overhead. Let's do a couple overhead squats. Bring it down. You can move side to side in your squat before coming up. Make it more of a warm up. Two more. Just doing five. Last one. Can you even rock side to side? And up. Now we can end with our jumping jacks. Let's do some jumping jacks. Give me five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out, good job. Grab some water. Alright, so today's workout is an EMOM every minute on a minute. Each EMOM set we're going to do for five times or five minutes total. We have two exercises that we're going to try to get through as fast as possible and then the rest of the time is to rest. Y'all should know what an EMOM is by now. I think we've probably been doing a lot of them in our quarantine life. All right. Let me show you the first set. We have 10 in and out squats. In and out squats. Down nice and low. I'm going 10, 9, 8. So I'm going out and in. In and out squat jumps. If you want a more of a low impact option, do step out squats. That's one, two, three, four. So that's your low impact option. Then we're hitting the ground. We have a single arm tricep push up. So we're here, extending up like so. We're going to do 10 on each side. And the rest of our time is ours to rest. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Hope you're all ready. Turn on a good song or two in the lineup for the next five minutes. We're going to go ahead and get started in 10 seconds. In and out squats start in five, four, three, two, begin. One, two, three, four. Once you're done with that, tricep push up. One arm down, one arm crosses. Whew. Those tricep single arm push-ups don't have to be a big movement. They can be small, but wow, they're tough. Next EMOM starts in 10 already. Three, two, one, next round.
Seconds left. Ten. Final five. Next round begins. If you're doing the low impact option of step out squats, you're doing ten of those. Maybe only do five tricep push ups on each side just because this is taking a little bit longer than it would if you were hopping in and out. So if you feel like you don't have enough time to do the low impact and all 10, that is a good option to do. Five seconds. All right, next round. is up 15 seconds 10 seconds final round we have one more left five four three two let's begin finish out strong this is our final time through stay nice and tight with the tricep push-ups. Remember, it doesn't have to be a big movement. You have to go have to go down to the mat every time. Just gotta use the back of those arms. Single arm, single side. Just tapping my opposite side elbow down to the ground, pressing up. You did 10 on each side every round. We just did 50 of those. Finishing up in five, four, three, two, and done. Done, done. Woo! Grab some water. How'd that first round go for everyone? Some thumbs up. We have more, more fun where that came from. Next round while y'all are grabbing some water, we have, yes, thanks Barb. We have skaters and push-ups. Skaters, everyone loves a good skater. Skater. 20 total, 10 on each side. Use your arms, cross over, low impact. You're stepping, but you're moving quick. Stepping, but moving quick for those skaters. 20 total, 10. Then classic, classic push-ups. Tap them. You can also do them from your knees. Always modifications. All right, next EMOM. Next set starts in 10. Five, four, three, two, 
Five seconds, we have skaters. Two, begin. Great job, everyone. 20 seconds left this minute. 15. seconds left. Down to 20. Hope your heart rate's up. Mine is. 15. Next round in three, two, one. Begin! Woo! Keep moving, keep hopping, big hops! This is our final round, make it count! Last 10 push-ups. Can you move, can you do a few from your knees to your toes? Even if you just do two, that's still better than zero. Just try, practice. Woo! When you're done, pat yourself on the back to use some 50 push-ups. That's a lot. <laughs> Great 
job. Finish it up for three, two, one. Beautiful. Grab some water if you haven't already. Great job, everyone. We are cruising through the workout. Hopefully y'all are having a lot of fun. Moving really quick here. All right, I'm gonna show you our next two moves. Taking about a minute off in between each round. Set number three. We are gonna be on the mat the whole time. We have a Superman roll into a V up. Watch me first, then I'll show a modification. Superman, roll over. V up. Here's your modification. Low impact rolling doesn't feel good. You're just doing 10 Supermans. Then you're gonna turn over and do 10 V-ins. So you can either do a full V-up, V-up here, V-up or V-in on your elbow. It would be like that. Second exercise, we have our 20 total 10 on each side plank taps. So just tapping back and forth. Of course, you can do this on your knees as well. That one's gonna be more of our cardio move. So we're gonna do about six to 10 Superman's to V-ups. I'll let you guys know when we hit 30 seconds if that's your indication to move on to the next one. So aim for 10, minimum of six there, and then 20 plain taps, 10 each side. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get started in 10 seconds. Six to 10, Superman to V up. Begin. All right, we're at 30 seconds. Move on to plank taps. Woo! There you are, you back down 10 seconds. Let's change it up. Let's do five Supermans and two V-ups. So I'm doing five now. Save on some time in our minute. Five Superman, five V-ups. And then hit plank tap for 30 seconds down. Three. Woo! This is a tough round. All the way down to 10 seconds again. Three. Two, one, five Supermans, five V-ups. Whether you're doing a banana roll or you're just doing five and five. Oh, keep going. 
30 seconds down. Switch to plank taps. Even if you're on your knees with this one, keep your tummy tucked in. Keep your butt from going up like this. Keep it tucked in the one straight line. We're already down to 10 seconds. Five Supermans, five V-Ups, coming at you. Let's go. Round four. Thirty seconds down. Switch to plank taps. Woo! Fifteen seconds. Done. One more final round after this. Let's begin. Round five. Five Supermans. Five V ups, whether you're rolling into it or you're just doing five and five. This is your workout. So do whatever's best for you. Thirty seconds down. Hit the plank taps. Tuck your tailbone in. Bring your pelvis down a little bit. Tuck it in. Try and keep from having a big high butt. Final ten. And cool down. Woo! Grab some water, my friends. Wow, my heart rate is up. I hope yours is too. We're making great time. We have two, um, one to two more rounds to get through. And then we're all good to rock and roll for the day. Set number, um, set number four, we have a donkey kick with the penguins, so a little bit more core donkey kick. We have 10 total, five on each side. Let me show you, y'all gonna be mad, don't worry, there's a low impact. We have donkey kick, up and over. Five on each side, 10 total, low impact. I just want you to do a knee in here, outside knee in. Little knee crunch. After that, we're gonna flip onto our backs. We have 20 penguins. 20 total penguins, 10 each side. All right, that's our next round. Hope y'all are ready. Our minute is up. We're starting in 10. Donkey kick, 10 total, or knee crunches. On your backs, penguins, 20 total. Woo! 
25 seconds to go. Fifteen, ten. Second round starts in five, four, three, two, begin. Remember the low impact of the donkey kicks is same side knee crunch. Once you do 10 of those, we move on to 20 penguins. Woo! 15 seconds. seconds so we start again. Donkey kicks our same side knee and start in three, two, one, let's go. Seconds down, 30 to go. Down to 20. Next round starts in 10. Next round in three, two, seconds down, 30 to go. Down to 20. Ten seconds, final round, fifth round. Make it good, five. Final round, let's begin. Finish up, finish strong here. When you're done, grab some water. We have one more set left. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. We started a little late today, so I hope it's okay. We go a few minutes over. We have one more set left. Set number five. I want to give you guys some full 25 minutes of work today. Last one. We're back to standing. We're going to stand and hit the mat. So do a little, little bit of both again. We have a single leg deadlift into a high knee hop, 10 total. 
five on each side. So five on each side for this one. Single de leg deadlift. Single leg deadlift down. High knee hop. So five of those. Low impact, no hopping. Going down. High knee step. If your balance is a little off, that's okay. You don't want to waste time wiggling all over the place. Just do the movement in a staggered stance and then come up. So it's better to go staggered, really use the lower body, than to um, do single leg deadlift, throw your balance off. After that, we're on the mat. With some leg lifts. Do 10 to 15 leg lifts. You can make it harder by pulling your head, neck, and shoulders up, looking at your belly button. You can make it low impact by keeping your head down, your knees bent, hands underneath the booty. We're going to go ahead and get started in 10 seconds here. Single leg deadlift to high knee hop. Starts in three. Let's go. Five on each side. Ten to fifteen leg lifts for thirty seconds now. Twenty seconds now. Whew. Next row starts in ten. Five seconds, we start. Staggered to high knee hop. Remember, go staggered and step. Just make it quick. Thirty seconds down, thirty to go. Ten to fifteen leg lifts. Keep your belly tight, pulled in. The closer you get down to the ground, the harder it's going to be. The more your shoulder blades are pulled up, head, neck, and shoulders up, the harder it's going to be as well. You have ten seconds till our next round. Three, two, one, begin. Thirty seconds down, thirty to go. Whew. Ten seconds. Next round starts in five, round four. Let's go.
30 down, 30 to go. Fifteen seconds. Final round in ten. Let's get going. Last one, make it count. Best one yet. Fifteen seconds left. Final five. Three, two, done. Great job, everyone. Let's hit the mat. Let's do a little cool down. Thumbs up all around. Give our jelly time. Feet together, knees apart. Just move into it. Oh, that was fun. Okay, so next week we'll be back next two weeks for more fun. One leg out and reach over. Switch your legs. Right in, left out. Just like to move with it a little bit. Bring the legs together. Stretch one arm across your chest, pat yourself on the back. You can even move back and forth if that feels good. Switch sides, pat yourself on the back, rock back and forth. Great job. To the mat, down on our bellies. Hands underneath, cross up nice and tall. Look up. We do a big shoulder stretch here. So one arm down, one arm across. You can move side to side or you can just rest into it. Switch sides, one arm underneath. Right arm over, stretch it down or rock side to side. Do a lot of push ups, tricep push ups. So I want to really make sure our shoulders are stretched out. All right, hands underneath. Press yourself up, tabletop. Bring your legs back, downward facing dog. Bring your feet, tiny steps into your hands. Forward fold, roll it all the way up, stretch up overhead. Shake it up. And that's your class. Thanks for joining me today, everyone. I had fun. I hope you guys did too.